It's already started. Oh. <laughs> All right. What is up, everybody? Video addict here, and I've got a box. It's a little, I don't know, late, early. I don't, I don't know. This is Barrel and Blade. Alright, I, I don't know what happened. I believe that I lost a month because of like a shipping snafu. I don't know. So I have to see, I don't know which one this is gonna be, but I, I missed a month somewhere. Because I know I did August, but I didn't get a September. And now it's October. I don't know what happened. I talked to the guy, he said, I'll get right on it and I'll get you something out. And I'm like, you know, I'm not trying to give you a hard time because, you know, they send this to me for free and I appreciate them immensely. So, uh, Barrel and Blade, I don't know which month it is. All right, open up the box. This is what you're gonna see. We got a card. And we got what looks like a bag. Operation 39, does it say a month? It does not say a month. Ooh, ooh. All right, here's your card. And it looks fantastic. One, two, three, four, five. We have five items. There is one of those little items. Oh my goodness. What? What? We got a great box. I'm gonna love this box. Alright, so this and this, we're gonna set over here. Okay. First thing we're gonna go with is the Cyclops. The Cyclops is a. Uh, this is not a multicolor. Four white LED bulbs. Alright. So this is a hat light. Just clips onto the front of your thing. I actually have some of these that do green lights and whatnot, uh, that go red, green, and, and white, and they are awesome. These things are so nice when in a jam, 28 lumens, it's very nice walking into a stand, not blaring out the whole place. So this is a useful item. And it's an $8 item, so not, not bad at all. We have crinkly paper. Ooh, I'm excited about this. Those of you who, if you've ever, if you went and watched my blade show uh, thing, I think I showed y'all the knives that Jay and I bought from this company. So I'm pretty excited to see what it is. But first off, let's get past barrel and blades needs to be like everybody else and tell you to be safe and to wear a mask. So we have the barrel and blade mask. They have a different kind of mask here. I guess it's meant for you to kind of keep it around your neck and then pull it up. Look, barrel and blade logo, yep. 
It's another logo. It's very, very soft. T-shirty. T-shirt material, kind of soft. It's got a little, one of those bending pieces that goes there on your nose. That's very nice. It's actually a very nice mask. Made in Honduras. Should have sterilized it first. Ugh. All right. I like it. I will allow it because I like it. It's very, very soft. <laughs> okay. Next. And I don't, I guess I'll go ahead and do this one. Because I know I'm excited about it. I hope you are too. I need to get out my rate knives that I got. I was thoroughly impressed with them. They have some very, very, very nice knives. And this is the P801SF, $33. I think Jay and I bought our knives there. They're, they're like 25 bucks. They were trying to get rid of them uh, so they didn't have to take them back or whatever. But the guy was just like, 25 bucks. I was like, what? <laughs> like, these are nice knives, man. I was like, how much are they normally? They're like $38. I was like, what? Oh, Rake is actually, wait a minute. Rake is actually making like Swiss Army knives. Betcha those are awesome. Dude, those look sweet. Man. All right. Now, while this says R-U-I-K-E, it is, however unlikely it is, it is pronounced rake. I don't know why, it just is. Oh, I, I, I just saw this knife at Smoky Mountain Knife Works and I almost bought it. I loved this knife. Or did I buy it? Was that the one that I bought? Surely not. That gummit. Did I buy this one? <laughs> I think I did. Hold on. Let me check it. Let's go to the box. <laughs> dum dum dum. Alright, uh. That's not it. Oh, it is the one. No, wait. Oh, no, it's not. It is very similar to the one that I bought. I don't know if you can see. <laughs> Those things are very, very close. Uh, same kind of just steely finish. But um, this one is different. Has a blue clip. Flipper action. Oh, my God. It's awesome. That is, I'm going to tell you something, guys. These knives are so freaking smooth. And these guys are freaking tough. Jay beats his up. Because, I mean, think about it. At $33, what do you care? But you've got a freaking sweet knife. I swear to you, guys, go check out their website, please. Please look at their knives. It's R-U-I-K-E, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, R-U-I-K-E. And look at the knives. You will not be disappointed with these knives, man. Uh, this one is, what was it again? The P801SF. And it is so freaking smooth. Watch this. <laughs> Bam. I love this knife and I mean you if you want to talk about sharp they're I mean they're just no oh dude just like butter I mean I could shave my face with this thing that's how sharp it is I don't have any paper how do I not have paper 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 what do I got uh, what do I got here uh, something from Bed Bath & Beyond. <laughs> okay, if you've ever gotten Bed Bath & Beyond stuff, it's like heavy duty paper. 
Okay, it's like almost cardstock, only not. Look at that. I mean, guys, these are really, really, really nice knives. I didn't cut my coupon. <laughs> not like you need it. I'll get another one three hours from now. Bed Bath & Beyond probably sensed that I cut that one and they've already shipped me out another one. That is awesome. This is the rake knife I got from Smoky Mountain Knife Works. And it's bad to the bone. I think it's in my, like my carry around. Anyways, these dang GoPros, I swear to God, they're going to be the death of me. Uh, anyway, I don't have the other rig that I bought, but I mean, this right here is the P108SF, and this is the P801SF. This knife I loved at Smoky Mountain Knife Works. I didn't see this one, but I love this one as well. This is a bad to the bone knife. Very, very good job, barrel and blade. Again, that's R-U-I-K-E. They pronounce it rake. I love this. Man. All right, barrel and blade. Keeping it strong during the corona. Very good. Uh, let's hope. My GoPro don't cut off again. I want to go look at their dang set, uh, multi-tool knives. Those things look awesome. All right. Next up, we have a pair of Walker's electronic headphones. All right. These right here are an $80 MSRP. This is the Walker Razor electronic earmuff. Now, I've talked about it a few times on my channel about the ringing in my ears and it's, I don't believe it's from like shooting guns and whatnot. It's just from life in general, uh, years of playing football and stadiums that are just like, you know, I mean, I played in some big places and some big games. So, you know, my hearing isn't the best and these walkers i actually have a set of the higher end ones because i wanted to get some that were really 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 good uh these are awesome i started with these and then they had a sale during christmas last year or something and i think i did a review on them you should go back and check them out uh just look up walkers whatever on my channel uh they are phenomenal i think i did the video on it like six months ago maybe but um please 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 protect your hearing it's there's nothing worse than to be sitting like right here even now and just having just ringing in your ear just like a high pitch all the time i have to sleep with something on just to drown out that high pitch tone it's miserable so Highly, highly, highly recommend the walkers. They are comfortable. They fold down into a really good compact carry around. So uh, very, very cool. I highly recommend, highly, highly, highly recommend them. And last but not least, we have a bag from Fox Tactical. Super excited about this. Ooh, this is nice. Look, we got a fire tactical patch included. Mmm, smells like gunpowder. <laughs> it don't really. So what is this? This is the Fox Field and Range Tactical Bag. $70 MSRP. I'm telling you, Barrel and Blade killed it this month. You have a real nice shoulder strap here. That is Velcro. You're going to move it right there. 
or you can just unclip it from the sides, your choice. You have some hook and loop here on the back and some molly webbing, very nice. You have a water bottle holder here on the end and on this end as well, or just extra storage, whichever you decide. Inside, we have two zippered pockets. Ooh, this whole thing is kind of like, I wouldn't call it hook and loop, but it's kind of got that velvety, whatever that hook, that Velcro will stick to. And then here you have a couple mesh pockets with Velcro enclosures, Velcro closures. So that's very nice. And on this side, oh look, you already have a little holster right here, ready for you. One of those little all size gun, or that may be a mag holster. I think that's a mag holster. But yeah, like I was saying, you, this is all hook and loop compatible. You have two more mesh pockets on this side. You could put some clips in here. You can put your pistols in here and just clip it to it. Very, very nice. Very nice bag, man. And again, on this side, you have the Fox Tactical patch along with more hook and loop here with Molly webbing. Very nice, man. I am freaking stoked. Everybody, this is a awesome, awesome box. I mean, you got a pair of walkers, game ears, and now, don't get me wrong, uh, they're giving it an $80 MSRP. I think you can get them around $49, you know? Uh, I, I know that they are right around 80 bucks, but they pretty much always have a sale on them somewhere. So just keep that in mind if you decide that you're gonna go buy a pair of them. I highly recommend them. Um, the Fox Tactical Bag, they're giving that a $70 value. It is a good bag. And I love that it's got the Velcro, it's got the shoulder strap. I, I really, really, really like that bag. So that's really nice. The Cyclops Mini, Mini Light, not a bad deal at all. Um, the Barrel and Blade Tactical Face Mask, a little gimmicky, but it's the world that we live in. Uh, it's a very comfortable mask. I don't, I'm not a big fan of the the two bands, the one that goes around the back here, the one that goes on the top here. I like the ones that just hook over your ears, even though they kind of suck too, because they just pull your ears forward and over time they start to rub you or just irritate you. Um, the, it's, it's the $33 item of the box, but I'm gonna tell you right now, this is absolutely probably my most favorite thing in the box just because i have been wowed by the quality of this company and the knives that they put out and i love their knives i would love to be a part of their company and promote their knives if they are listening to this please send me some knives to review i wish i could buy them all but I cannot. <laughs> the Walker's Game Ears, great. Bag, great. This is amazing. Face Mask and Cyclops, both winners. Uh, that's it, guys. I can't gloat anymore about this box. It's awesome. Everything in here is great quality, and you would not be unhappy if you got this box. So if you are interested in getting a box like this, Check out the description below. I have a discount code. Use it and save yourself some cash. I get nothing from it. Nada, not a dime. I don't get a percentage, I don't get anything. So they do send me the free box. I do appreciate that. Thank you very much, Barrel and Blade. Appreciate you. Uh, 
but that's all I get from it. And I don't, it's not based off of how many people I get to sign up. I mean, <laughs> because whenever I missed that month, and I think it was because I moved, whenever I moved out here, I had them change my address and it actually messed something up in their system. So he shipped me one right out, which I'm super excited he did um, because I'd have hated to miss this knife, honestly. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I mean, Bro and Blade, I mean, whenever I told him that, he's like, dude, you're, you're on our reviewer list and you will always be on our reviewer list. And I was like, that, that makes me feel good, you know? But I, I am that guy because they make me that guy. They make me be a good reviewer for them because they send good stuff. That's all I can say about them is they send good stuff. And then it only matters what you think. So tell me what you like. Tell me what you didn't. And in the comments below, like, share, comment, all that fun stuff. And subscribe. I'm out.